Thanks for mezzing around. Vampire Survivors Beswick 338. The Vampire Survivors Castlevania collab continues with Grant Dynasty. You want to just check the chapters? You want to skip ahead all the giggly gop? Triggers any equipped knives and retaliation or went over healing by plus eight. Yay, Grant. You know, in the splash screen, it showed 19 character, the 19 base characters, but Grant was missing, even though there's 20 of them. Also, everyone else is sort of push themselves up the list, I guess. I don't know why. I guess to get Quincy in line with the others. I've also sealed off my collection and unlocked but not bought some other characters. Uh, because doing the thing with Richter, the event with Richter, actually doesn't count towards the win, I just did a quick hurry run with him to do stuff and it unlocked a bunch of other characters. But right now it's Grant time and it's going to be Quincy time, it seems. <laughs> All right. Make sure to take hurry off. I don't want to hurry. Oh, I get the full breath of Grant. Oh, arrow. Okay. And as it should be tellable from the map, there are a whole lot of new pickups everywhere. Also, the map is even larger than it was before. Like, good God, man. Yeah, so we got Hector's thing. Yeah, it said Familiar Forge, and it said something with Hector for that in the collection. A new boss in the top left, some weird foot thing on the bottom, as along with another armadillo, a coffin, another boss. Uh, another boss in there next to the Targe. And I, more more stuff on the right, too. Looks like it got... Holy crap, 70 speed? Grant, go. Alright, so I sealed... Sealed off most of the everything. The other DLCs plus most of the base stuff. I only left in the whips, because, well, obviously. And the knives, because, well, Grant gets something like that. Alrighty. Oh, I need to go grab that curved knife face up, huh? Alright, pretty much Tempest Evolves. Oh, hmm, 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 Arcana. Ouch. Er, I haven't left at home as a bad thing. Yay. Maybe I could find some health. I mean, it's got to be wings with that foot down there. It wouldn't make any sense for something that looks like that to not be wings, right? I think one of the Arcana that shows the evolution of it, too, has wings on the foot. And I don't know about the Forge thing. Well, it doesn't make sense. Oh, heart refresh. Some health off of that. Get a lot of health off of that. You're not even particularly frail. I'm just getting beat up bad. I'm looking for a knife, Invento Sacro. Oh, she got Invento Sacro over actual whip. Vintage damage good. There's three armadillos on the map, so I could be a bit reckless. Knife, Invento Sacro. You want to heal. That's why I wanted a regular whip. The Invento Sacro to Puapa Walla. Bloody Terran. Since when he overheals, he launches off another knife. That's good. He doesn't want more knives. There's some overhealing. More knives. Empty home duplicator. Whatever else. Nope, I need Vento Sacro first. No chance I can guarantee a candy box. <laughs> Roll off. Make normal healing better, but 
Doesn't much matter. It's all about the bloody tear healing that we're gonna get onto. More knives, more. You know, I want bouncy knives too, won't I? Not bad. Okay, grab the stuff I know, then I can go venture down. Alright, I'm gonna want wings with one of the armadillos. Or, wait, actually, I don't need to venture down. Want to just to explore it? I have mad groove. Wow. Nope, one revive rocked, and I don't have any other revives. Huh. It's media than it should be. Something feels off. Hmm. Oh, well, the fact that I can't hit anything doesn't help. Oh, finally got you out. Thin edge. Knife. Hey, knife. Oh, knife. Double evolve, hey you. Not getting anything from the arc a uh, second arcana doesn't hasn't been helpful. Oh right, I need the bracer max out for it too. Hot roasting. Hollow heart. No, that's four chicken, not pot roast. Neutron bombed. Trying to get block a knife up. Wee wee. They're fighting the good fight. Man, does it hurt not to have empty tome? in any reasonable time frame. Oh. Oh boy. This is not looking good. Lucky pick up there. Nothing lucky there. Oh, sorry. More pot roast looking. Ooh, good. That's very helpful. Just get bracer. If I can just get bracer. Uh oh. Oh, that was timed very well. See, you have a ton of luck too. 80 luck. Yeah, geez, Grant. You're clearly Ponkel's favorite character. I guess you have lower might. I don't know what the base mites are. Okay, I have three chests. I can run... Wait, I don't need it maxed out? Huh. Okay, now let's just get some power-ups here. Okay, yeah, it's kind of nutty. Man, and they can get bounces too. That's kind of crazy. Oh boy. That's a lot of unlocked DLC weapons now, huh? Man, it's still not enough. Heart refresh. That costs some help. There's Bracer maxed out. Fly, knives, fly. There's Vento Sacro. Only Behesses now. Wait, 
Witch only at three, geez. A lot of stuff having to come up. Damn, it should be fine considering. On the other hand, also, shouldn't be fine considering. Ouch. At least I can finally see the block of knives in real action. No arcana goblins either. Never a good sign. Cater works. You can get that armadillo, but I don't want to leave this chest. Da -da -da. Come on, just give me my knife so I can thousand edge. Got a heart. I don't know whether that counts as a weapon or an item up there. I'm presuming a weapon, the forge thingy. Good grief. There's knives. Now yeah, we can just walk through things. Con eyeball. Not very big. Not very big at all. He has, like, much lower attacking stats, huh? Oh, come on, give me something new. A weapon. Go figure. Alright, first we get a Tiradisu, then we go back around to start grabbing other stuff. Yeah, with all these extra bosses, Vampire Killer would have been a better idea. Shots. Is more damage. Our gem. Round it up. Brown Grant, the King of Pirates. Take that, Luffy. Take that, Luffy. Oh boy. Oh. No, I can still get Gemma Torpa. In fact, I should definitely get Gemma Torpa. Or Rock Riot so I can get Gemma Torpa. Whipping that action. Avento Sekro's got nothing. Absolutely nothing. Alright, looks like I'm going to be selling for the guaranteed Arcana at 11 of this, right? Red Gem, not a level. This armadillo. Let's get empty tome. Is wow, do I need empty tome? Huh? Oh no, that's the gate below me. Just the map being so zoomed out made it hard to tell. So much to go through. You need to move. Man, I do not have a lot of knives, huh? Far fewer knives than I wanted. Yeah, a full overhill build would probably be exceptionally nice. But I don't have that. Okay. That whip's almost up. Man, you're enduring a lot, eyeball. You're a very durable eyeball, eyeball. Eyeball, eyeball. The eyes have it. Regular whip. Get Jet Black up, and then evolve that. Do more McGill tip. Oh wait, I have to use this uh, burn down slogan and Gaiba. Fan that flame out. And even with three evolutions, things aren't going well. Man, I got a lot of knives around everywhere. Ooh, overhealing. More knives. Regular whip. Let's start getting closer to Bloody Tear. I don't have Candelabra to work. I'm not going to have a lot of increased area on it, huh?
Walla, walla, that's my goal. Energy so out of the pool. Empty tome, because it's empty tome. Back row. Now I'm starting to get some damage out. On armor. Could be worse. Whip. Bloody tearing. There we go. Now, we go like mad, right? Right? Let's get Hunter Sacro first. Faster I can get the full off wall, then I can get another weapon. And then check what the heck this blue crystal familiar forge thing is. Da -da 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 -da. All knives everywhere. Charge and charge. Arm and arge. Arm and agus. Okay, this is... Oh, this new boss is right next to this room. A uh, hidden wall? Yeah, you're pointing to it, huh? Let's try and get the... Dang it. Hey, it's the creature. How's it going, creature? Bad? Oh, that's never good to hear. Well, you know how life goes sometimes. Badly. That would be nice. Oh, does Block a Knife not get crits? That seems like an oversight. Uh. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. Oh, that's the other Dominus. Probably you're not supposed to get. Okay, I want to bounce the block of knives. I want to explore and unlock everything. I don't want to just go straight. Oh, hey. No, I can't grab that just yet. Oh, that's where the lightning one is. Yay, that'll help. Hollow heart out of the pool. If you tome out of the pool. Spam up into sacro as much as I can. Dang, I was really hoping for faster than that. For first. And then just a quick whatever for the final slot. Then I can go running and hope I can get wings at some point from a bolero chest. Perhaps this bolero chest will give it to me. Arm Aegis. Arm Aegis. Right, I'll save that one for the evolution. Walla for Wallow. Or at this rate, Sonic Whip into Sonic Blaster Tip? No. Wind Whip into, like, Windstorm Tip. Oh, you've got a red gem. Oh, it doesn't want to give me a Vento Sacro at all. At all. No Vento Sacro. Well, that'll get me more XP. Ooh. And it gets me uh, another Vento Sacro level. Good. Wind. Vento Sacro up. What else is there to be? You're hoping there's a boss coming in. Another eyeball. Come on. Let me evolve off you. No. Ugh. Bone mask. This is not good. I don't want to be faster to try and go somewhere else. I mean, 
This gotta be a boss of the next minute mark. If not, I have another chance of rolling. Da da da. Thing I'm a gig. Next boss's boss is Doppelganger. That's a quite a run. Orange is just in the center. All right. Hopefully this pulls it off correctly. Da 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 da. da. Come on, either boss or treasure goblin. There we go, Fwalu Fwalu. Yeah, we just level up. Gale Force. Elecard Spear is fine. Oh, go. Invincible Fulgor. Oh, he dropped another chest. Wings! Nope. Uh, you were Duplicator, so I'll actually be able to evolve you. Do I care about Doppelganger? Well, I've unlocked Sylpha because I've eaten Thorga and Gaiden. Man, I never come this way. I have no idea what the terrain looks like. And good thing, too, because it's a nightmare to move through. How many levels to get? Nah, it's not going to be... Oh, to destroy the chest with it? That's quite unfortunate. Knives! My knives are better than your knives, fake Grant. They'll actually hit things, which makes them astounding for this, frankly. It's actually amazing how many weapons just sort of vaguely don't fire in the direction of anything. Ironically makes, like, Holy Wand probably the best weapon here. More knives. I will outknive you. You've been outknived, fake Grant. Woohoo. God, he jumps so high because his speed is so huge. Yeah, it doesn't look like the chest respawns. That was badly timed then. But I gained nothing from that. Really. Wait, no, it's back. I guess it takes some time to come back. Maybe I have to get off screen. No, that's a regular chest. Okay, whatever. Ogor is the better one since that should evolve with Duplicator. Huh, that red gem there is moved. Alright, Familiar Forge. I think that's what you're called. What are you going to give me? Hammer gets so wonky moving out of that section. Alright, so it allows you to summon a familiar. Oh, a familiar. I can do anything. Uh, I could so look back. The bitter fly, the alleged ghost, and him. Sacred cardinal. Fairy, Sacred Turtle, Sacred Tiger, Sacred Dragon, Wood Rod, and a Pumpkin. Uh, well, I guess Grant's pretty bitter fly. Because he keeps getting ignored. Okay, so that counts as a passive, as with one thing in it. Alright, some more stuff. There wasn't a boss here before. Can I keep going up? Huh. Did it, uh... Oh, hey, is that a Gaiben? Yeah, it is. Hi, Gaiben. Wait, are you like an enemy or are you bosses? Oh, whatever. Yep. Hello. 
goop thing. Oh, Arcana Goblin. This is the butterfly even do. Oh, it looks like it has a garlic effect. That's kind of neat. That means you can get triple stink. Woo. Where's Tonitris? Maybe it'll actually not be terrible now. Okay, critical hits. That actually affects a lot of my stuff, so. And Grant has huge luck. That's good. Ooh, another book. Da -da -da. Caramat Bubbles fires slow moving damage zones. Why do I want to say that that's your name? Also, doesn't that just. Oh, wait, I can aim it. Oops. A projectile. Oh. Okay, so it is not like holy water or Santa water at all. One more projectile. It requires max since it's a spell book. A max something since it's a spell book. And levels up are going up nicely now. Back last longer. Oh, that'll probably no it can't be spellbinder. Oh what? An orbitor? Tractor. A lot of things it could be. Big red gem. Not so big. I'll level up there. Eight. Alright, let's see. Ooh, it will evolve. Neat. Evolves with max armor. What? Also triggers a slimy swarm that chases enemies down. I'll save this chest till after this boss. So I can get a crown. Goopy. Or I can get a silver ring. Hmm. Hope I can get wings off the black chest here. Damn, my damage has gotten really high. I'd rather hold off on getting the chest since I'll come back. Well, no, I can pop one. No, if I get wings some point somehow, then it's better to have it out, just in case I can evolve a spear. Oh, I'm still not allowed in here. All right, then, since I'm not coming back, grab these. They're gonna be faster. To go around. I think it'll be faster to just take down the boss and then go around. Get the armor deal. I wonder if it's gonna let me actually go down. I mean, it's... Might be locked off too by another gate. What would I. I did a creature caramat gave those. Why did I just call it caramat? Do I actually know the name of that boss and didn't realize it? Am I assuming it just on the spell book? That would be weird. It's not like it's Zephyr's Gale Force. Also, this is insanely good. Like, holy crap. Spell books are mad good. Like, he got annihilated so badly there. Uh, well, random always. It's 100% gotta be wings for that other thing. And I can get discus. Not quickly. Man, I've got no time, really. Ten minutes is not enough to explore all this. But I really shouldn't be going for this. I should be going straight for the wings. Oh, well. I made my choice, and now I'll pay. No, it was Abaddon who gave the one for uh, Kingsgate. Hmm. Alright, so go down, fight Shadow Guy. 
with Shadow Guy taken out. I haven't even needed to fight him. I shouldn't fight him, in fact. It's a waste of time. Eyeballs, though. Eyeballs are always good to fight. Give me wings. Not disc. <laughs> wings are definitely necessary. I refuse to believe that I live in a world where that foot thing there that has wings on evolution doesn't evolve with wings. Then I can go down there, unlock the coffin, which is going to be Reinhard Schneider, the protagonist of Castlevania 64. I have a distant relation with the Belmont clan. Now, yes, I could just use... Actually, could I use Mad Groove? A lot of things don't get pulled correctly, even if they're on the map. More knives, more. Less discs, more knives. Less discs, more knives? Now when I get that big red gem, it's... Oh, it's not that one. Or that one. The heck? I got really messed up there. And I just did this too with Richter. I wanted to make sure I got all eight of them whips. Strangely, it tracks independently the eight whip evolutions. And the things that actually do happen. Because I actually quit out because I wanted to seal things to make it easier on myself. And then it gave me the Morning Star, which hasn't actually popped up here. Huh. wasn't in the collection either. What was off with that? I really am not getting a lot of XP, huh? That's peculiar. Well, I should have at least triggered the boss. They would have followed me and I could have just killed it at my leisure. Well, probably would have died to bubbles. Speaking of bubbles, this right doesn't need to be fully maxed out. Now I'll do wind blasts everywhere, making it crazier than ever before. I mean, the creature, those two new bosses aren't ain't anything. Like, do I need to fight all the bosses before that top left room opens up, or do I need to find something down low? Well, either way, we'll be soon. Well, that's fine. Kind of annoying. Oh, the spear is so nice. Come on, wings. Goop everywhere. Isha might actually be better than Numa Tempest. Can I grab you yet? Oh, hey, that got fixed. There must have been a small hidden patch or something. Oh, or maybe it got unlocked with the expansion of the map. And it was just an accident. It wasn't grabbable. Alright. Let's head on over here, hopefully. Yay. Let's go grab that boot. Oh, a lot of heart pressures popping up. Sonic Dash increases the move speed by 10% per level and damages nearby enemies. Area and speed increase damage. Oh, that's amazing. That looks like it was Nathan Graves' weapon. I don't know why, but hey. That means you can body block bash things, huh? Okay. We're gonna reduce by half a second. Wait, is it even making me faster? Uh, hmm. 
levels aren't... Yeah, I want levels because I want to guarantee it. I mean, five minutes should be enough time, but you know. Pull down reduced. 5.3 seconds. Alright, I should go unlock Sh Reinhardt Schneider. Which is the fourth coffin because Dracula counts as the third. Hi, Reinhardt. Thank you, Greg. Nasty, but the vampire is in another coffin. Okay. Reinhardt Schneider joins the survivors. Go on. Alright, boss, what do you got for me? Huh? Alright, on. Oh, there it is. It's... This thing. You... Good job. Yeah, she lasts longer. Went on respite. Well, I could just, you know, check my speed and oh god, yes, it does increase it. Holy moly, and yay! Allows clockwork weapons to materialize and grants access to a new part of Dracula's castle. Clockwork weapons? Oh wait, that's probably just an item. Or there's an entire another right side section. Oh my god. Why don't they give you the boots here? Oh wait, it increases my speed while it's active as an attack. Oh my god. I'm gonna respawn half a second. Oh, it's the caverns. It's the ice caves. There's the serpent's gate. That lasts half a second longer. Base damage up by 2.5. It's hard to find it. Well, granted, I could just go through all the walls. That's really out of the way here. Let's go get whatever this wolf thing is. That's probably for Cornell. Sonic Dash. Summons Kerberos' icy head in a face direction. Sinestro Kustros. Kustros. Oh, there's another boss. I think I can just run through the walls. Base area up 10%. Base area up 20. Or base damage up 20. Fires one more projectile. Bone is mana. Base area up 10%. Damage up 20. Discus. Fires one more projectile. Base area up 20%. Aroma. 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 Oh, it's only six, so it might be an auto evolve. Wow, that's a lot of levels I've been pushing. Oh, it's crab battle. This isn't a new boss at all. This is getting nutty with like the uh, moral and such. Ooh, hey, a tract orb. Dead? I can't tell. No, you've just been pushed so far out of bounds. You can't do anything. Or can. Dash boots. Woo. Off Sonic Dash also triggers a sec single shield charge. Absolutely 100% with wings. So. Alright, get the ice book. Ice fangin'. I can't have all that because I don't have. What call it? Also, this is hilarious. Oh, that's the vampire stars you know and love. Wait, where's the entrance to this? Wait, where the hell am I? What? Okay, so that's a proper way to get in. Here's another Kerberos head. Let's see if I can get that. Maybe it requires all three of them. I mean, that would just make total sense. Dextro Kirkos, which I did not hear the name of at all. Uh, Dextro Kustos, BC at 10%. Get the chest. Damage up 20. 
You can't read that. Oh, this is a great character to do this on. Who doesn't want 280% speed? Take that right, Death. Five. Oh, man. God, that's so much. Uh, boss. Boss, where are you at? There you are. There you are. Yeah, there you are. I don't know what you are, but I'm hitting you. You're a white blob. Let's go with that. Oh, right. Stellar Blade. Oh, you dropped something. X. Turn to moving damage zone. Damage effect by curse. I think I need that to unlock Shaft. What the hell? Oh my god, it's Legion. Platforming. Oh hey, I guess that giant skull there is Hex. Also, I can literally jump over it because my... <laughs> also, it has so much HP. Oh, that's what you expect from the old Grand Faloon, eh? Amazing. The LC is wonderful. All them deadly naked people. And yet, somehow, it's harder than normal Grand Faloon. Oh, because I'm facing the wrong way. Oh, wait, here's... Throw knives from below. Probably be more effective or whatnot. They don't bounce off it for whatever reason. Chew everything. I didn't see this on the unlocks. <laughs> Man, this is taking a while. I don't even have that much cur- I don't have any curse on. It's just beefy as all heck by default. Huh, not allowed to hit your core till all the parts are gone, huh? Actually, kind of hard. Hey, laser beams. Bitterfly only moves with me. Bye bye, Grand Faloon. Can you give me anything? Ooh, what's this? Ebony and Crimson Stones allows Elizabeth Bartley, Count Warlock's valid test perfectly and death to Morphlin's special conditions are met. What the hell? Playable Orlocks, Bullrocks, and death? I thought death would just be a skin. I get, well, I mean, Gallimoth was on the table since he was in the preview. Is there anything over here? I guess. Oh, it's a hidden path you have to go into to get here. I just managed to speed break through. My speed is just that crazy. Oh, it's another. I have no idea if this is normal section or what. Oh, uh, get Hex up. I mean, that's obviously going to evolve a skull, but I don't have skull. Sanger, that's irrelevant. Boss? Hello, boss. Or maybe. Yeah, you're spawning in. I don't know what you are. Can't tell what you are. I don't think it's feasible to tell what you are. Uh, that thing? Uh, oh, succubus. Bye, succubus. Oh, did you drop anything besides the chest? No gold ring? Unfortunate. Oh, and another arm of DOGs. Hey, that means I can't get skull. Skull! 
Solo Maniac. Seems unlikely it'll happen, but hey, other things can happen. I need the third one in order to unlock it, but... Or evolve it. Really? Okay. I must hate phrase preserved from above, drains health. Fifty seconds. Go first. Go first. Could at least be able to get it evolved. There is no way I believe it's anything. Oh, hey, it's some sort of centaur thing. Skull, chest. Evolution, yeah, exactly what you think. Nightmare, evolved hex, also triggers a negative energy zone that doubles curse when stepped into. What the hell? Well, that's very dangerous. Really, max out? No. Am I really out of rerolls? That seems unlikely. Hatred. Oh, you dropped another book, did you? No, you dropped a beast gate. That's it. Great. New part? Oh, is that the top left? Well, it must be because there's clearly nothing adding up top here. Oh, neat. Alright, final boss. Let's see if I can make... Well, I'm obviously going to make it. I don't know if I'm going to kill you in time, but I can try. Uh, where are you? Wow, you killed me instantly. There you are. I'm going to hatred that hopefully do it. I'll unlock it for more permanent use. Oh, it's like the fire beam for the teleport. Yeah, it should be a lot. 12 achievements, jeez. Beat Sklorian and Gaiba, well, full gore and current bubbles across any amount of runs. I open the fourth coffin and over to Castlevania. Reinhardt, then the server gate after PMS, clockwork weapons, new teleport for Dracula's castle. In the Beast Gate, Secret Weapons, New Teleport for Dark Elagor. On the Emony and Crimson Stones, unlocks more familiar for Elizabeth, Ulrox, Death, and Rat, Familiar Forge. Evolve the Caramut Bubbles. Evolve the Hex. Get the Dextro Custos to level 6. Get the Sinestro Custos to level 6. And get Dominus Hatred to level 6. Phew! Ran had quite the run, eh? And it's thousand edge of everything that gets the most damage at 14.2 million. But Thunderbolt Spear was at the most DPS at 13k. And of course, if Numa Tempest and Potus had shown up, that would have been the top by far. All right, Morbus did good. Tenebris Tenitris seems awful if it's getting 200. It's like Vento Sacro level. Things I couldn't even hit with. Uh, Hex really didn't get much play, but it could have been decent. Bubble seemed really good. A lot of the stuff otherwise didn't have time to play. That's Grant Dynasty down, and he unlocked so much. Next up's going to be Quincy Morris, though. Oh, it unlocked new characters. Megalo Elizabeth Bartley. Megalo Oldrox. Megalo Death. Megalo Dracula. Hold the stones that birthed your lineage and prove you hold dominance over all your monstrous minions. Unleash maximize death on the castle while holding the soul eating stones. Find the greatest treasure of the vampires and prove that the other count can wreak havoc in the castle. Ravage everything and everyone in Dracula's castle while in her demonic form. Good God. I don't even have their base forms, do I? No. I, the only one of those I have is Dracula's. Oh, no. that's There's Elizabeth. I don't have base Ulrox, and I don't have base Death. <laughs> that's kind of funny that I found it out that way. Well, next time it's going to be Quincy Morris. 
and uh, finding out more stuff. Fun, fun. Vampire Survivors, Ode to Castlevania. And good on Forgotten, Grant Dynasty has taken up to 1,972 on the Beswick. That leaves us with two and two, 476 to go. And a bunch of weird gaps have opened up just because Quincy Morris and other characters have inserted themselves wherever the hell they feel like it. It's actually really annoying with the way I'm doing this. Also could have been so much more annoying. If I wasn't recording this well after I already know that in advance, go figure. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. Please like, dislike, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed it. And thank you anyone who already has. Either way, have a good day and keep messing around in the Vampire Survivors Ode to Castlevania collab, Beswick style.